Right, so it's been a while since I've done a video. I've had some clothes come in and I thought I'd do a try haul. The sand was probably absolutely trash then because the crinkling of the bags. I've got loads of clothes from Shein here and then I've got a couple of things from this guy did just two things. So I'm just gonna try them on and then tell you what I think about them. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with misguided because I got only got two things in there. I got, I'll show you now. First I've got a pair of black joggers. Here they are. And um, I'll just try them on, I suppose. These are joggers, they're literally just basic plain joggers. And um, they're a little bit thing, but it's joggers, isn't it? So it's right if they're um, a bit baggy, yeah. So that's pretty much all I've got to say about them. They've got these um, white things, which I can adjust the waist, so that problem's not really there anymore. Anyway, yeah, so size 16 Boohoo joggers. I think they're literally just basic black joggers. If you type them on my website, you can see them. So the next thing I have is these black flares. Um, they're called recycled rib flare trousers and they're in size 16. So I'll just try them on and show you. Okay, so I absolutely love these. They seem, they are quite flattering, obviously they're bit tummy hugging if you don't like that you won't like it but yeah you can't really see the bottoms there we go um they are a bit long because i'm quite well i'm five four so you know i'll just hem them up at the bottom that's fine um i think these were like nine pounds and yeah i love them actually because that's all of boohoo that i and order two things from boohoo and I'm so excited for this bit, so let's get on to the sheer. Start with the accessories because I got three accessories. I've got a note, they've added in a pack of um, which one? disinfectant wipes, so it's a nice little addition. I think you get this if you spend over £35, so yeah, you know. Where did it go? <coughs> Never mind, excuse the free kind. First thing I got is, I'm pretty sure this is a little star necklace so yeah it just looks like this pretty sure it's just a choker i'm actually not going to try it on because i can't be bothered so next is i'm pretty sure this is a pack of earrings and i'm quite excited for these because i love earrings um it's just come it's come like this and then it's come in a little thing so they're all mixed up but i'll get a few out and show them to you like these ones Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> Sorry. These little, like, hoots of crosses. You see them? Lush. I love them. Um, I'll give you a few more examples. I'm not going to go for all of them because there are quite a few, like, different sets of earrings in here. So we've got some, like, uh, what do you call these? Feathers? set of them they're like little hoopy dangly ones rose cute anyway and now let's get on to the clothes oh i've also got a clear belt it's a bit dusty can you see that if i wipe away the dust see it's got some residue on my fingers and i'll show you that on with a thing if I uh, outfit when I wear that I need a belt so you'll see that in a minute um I actually ordered this top to go under another one of the tops I got so I mean I'll try it on it anyway this is just a large I think it said 14 to 16 right so I got a white bra on so don't judge that and I'm wearing the flares from the previous thing I'll probably be wearing this for a few of the tops um but it's just a literally average square neck top you know it's a it's a bit short like that's the end of my bra this is where it goes just under here and obviously these little bits are right but i wouldn't wear i wouldn't wear this on the same probably not but i think it'd be good for what i have to put over it so this is a little leopard print top i suppose um it is like see-through so that's obviously why i got this top and i think it's in size 
yeah, size extra large, so, you know. I probably could have got a large in this, but, you know, I think I've got extra large in most things. It doesn't exactly look like what I want it to look like with this top. I think I did get too big of a size. I do have a habit of going for a size too big. I'm usually quite untrustworthy with the size because they usually run quite small, so... I did decide to get an extra large in most things, I think, when I probably am just a large, but, you know, we move. Um, I just tied up the tops because they're a bit long. You know, I think this would be cute with a little black bralette, possibly, but it's not really looking... Obviously, if this was longer, this might look cuter because it's be more consistent, I suppose, but... I know, it's still cute and for, good for a price. You know, it's not my favourite thing. Um, you can see the strap, but this um tag, but I'd cut that out. So yeah, the back is just normal low cut back thing. I think this bra is for a milf as well because yeah, I don't think I would wear it with a bra, but you know, whatever. Another similar style top. I've been really excited about this one is this it's the same sort of like ruched and then lined i don't know how to call it but i love the color so i'm pretty sure this is extra large as well yeah extra large um i'm kind of regretting getting an extra large but you know we'll see how it looks I'm not gonna lie i do quite like this top it's a bit longer than the leopard print one. I don't. I would probably wear it if I was wearing it with these bottoms. I'd probably just be wearing it with some jeans or something. But I would probably tuck it up a bit just to give the waist definition. But this one I like a lot better. I think it's just because it's more structured, less flimsy. Um, back obviously you can see some rolls, but what are you gonna do? It's unavoidable. Um. This bit, I wish it was like fitted like under my boobs. I don't really have particularly big ones, so I don't know. You know, I feel like it just cuts in the middle, but other than that, I do quite like it. Next top, I don't really know why I bought this. I don't think I really like it, but you know, we'll see. It's like a. This does look quite big actually. This is probably an extra large as well yep um it's just one of those tops and like you can cinch it and stuff so this is quite cute i'm not gonna lie to you i thought it was big but then i put it on and it's not really that big i never really wear tops like this though so it's a bit different for me definitely do it like this to show a bit of stomach and then probably tie up the ends and that is actually really cute and i do quite like it I don't know about the, like, print, but I mean, it's summer. I think this style is really cute, and I might have to get some more tops in this style. <coughs> Underneath it, favourite top style. It's so cute. And that makes me look like I've got boobs, and I don't even. So that's brilliant. So I'm going to try on these shorts. They're an extra large too, and I'm, I'm a bit worried about the size. I don't know, they might be a bit small, because like, I don't know. Okay, so, they they can fit if I squeeze, they somewhat fit, but not really, I think they're a bit tight, and I think, I mean, they make my bum look really flat, ah! um, I think if I wanted to wear them, I would need to size up. Otherwise, like, they would be a perfect length. They do give you a bit of a camel toe, though, so... I think they could be cute, but... Swing and a, swing and a miss there. I'm going to try on the belt with them. Not that they need any help on the waist, but just to show the belt off. This is a cute belt. I like it. You know, there's... Oh, my God, that is awful. There's nothing really much else to say about the belt other than it's literally 
see-through thing. I do not need about with these shorts, as you can tell. But it's just a see-through. You know, it's cute. It's whatever. I'm going to try on this skirt. This is a lot darker than I expected it to be, actually. It's an extra large, so we'll see. This is quite cute. I quite like it. This slit is a bit dangerous. It shows the belly line, but what doesn't, you know what I mean? It's, a, it's to be expected. It's a thing tight skirt it's a bit it's actually quite a good length to be honest not too short i don't know it's right i'll probably give it like a six out of ten not a favorite not the worst probably gonna keep it i'll get used to it in the summer not much more to say about it really next thing i want to try on is this top now this was in plus size and i got in a 1x which said it's the uk 16 so it should be the same sort of size as this but i saw they did have it in straight size but they only went up to a 14 um in this in straight size so i thought i'd rather have it too big than too small if you know what i mean and if it doesn't work then i can send it back it's quite cute you know it's just a basic top, it's a nice little lettuce hem. Luckily it fit me. Um, there really is not a lot to say. Like, it is a bit see-through, but not like majorly. I don't know, it's cute. I would wear it with a pair of jeans, maybe. Denim jacket. Whatever. I quite like it, yeah. Now I've got two more things um a dress and a bikini so this is literally just a leopard print bodycon dress i suppose um i was thinking of wearing it with maybe a t-shirt underneath you know size extra large again you know you know the drill by now i'm not gonna lie to you i kind of hate this this top bit is let me come closer and show you oh my god this top bit's a bit baggy. And the straps are in a really weird place. And they're also a bit, they're a bit long. Um, if I wouldn't wear a bra, it might look better, but it just does absolutely nothing for me. It's really, um, like you can really, it's quite see-through actually. I don't know if you can see my pants, but oh my god, sorry if you can. I don't know. I don't know. It has potential, that's the problem. Okay, so I didn't really like that dress, but what are you gonna do about it? Um last but not least, it's the swimming costume. So recently I've just been kind of obsessed with cow print, like every other girl in this world. This um is a size large. It's like a bandeau top and then some high-waisted cow print bottoms and it's got the little adjustable bits on the sides. I kind of stand this. You, I hate the word stand but I don't know why you just use it but this is kind of really cute. Um, my only like slight issue is with the size of the top. Uh, it's not bad but I do like pulling them like up to here and then I don't really like these bits showing out, but you know, whatever. Like if I pull it there, it's better. But yeah, I thought I would have probably the coverage of the bottoms, but they're all right. One problem is that they do kind of cut in. They're really cool coverage on the bottom and on the sides, you know. Um, they do a little bit cut in to the bum cheeks, but I can't find a bikini that hasn't done that yet. I have nowhere to go though with this. That's the thing. England it is not hot. I am not going on holiday. Where am I gonna wear this? But I'm kind of in love. Bitch, I'm a cow. <sighs> Try not close tires you out. I don't even care what anyone says. It's a sport. Maybe I'm just unfit. So I've tried everything on now. Um, I'm actually really impressed with the amount of things I did like. 
only things which were issues were probably that leopard print dress and those shorts. That's pretty much the only things I kind of had issues with. But other than that, I pretty much liked everything, which is surprising for me. That's literally it. Sorry if I rambled on. I haven't done a YouTube video in a while and I don't know. I kind of want to get back into it with quarantine. Um, that's it. I really don't have anything else to say. Thanks for watching, I guess. Subscribe if you want and like and comment on what you want me to do. Any opinions, what your favourite piece was. I really want to know what your favourite piece on me was. And yeah, love you all, lots and lots, and I'll see ya. Bizzle kicks.